Hello and welcome. In this video, we will discuss the Coulomb's law of electrostatic force between two point charges. Suppose we have two point charges, Q1 and Q2, separated by a distance r. Then the Coulomb's law states that the force between these two point charges is proportional to the product of the charges, and it is also inversely proportional to the square of the distance between them. So combining these two, we get F equals to K, Q1, Q2, divided by R square, Newtons. Force is measured in Newtons. In this equality, K is called the Coulomb's constant. And K has a value equals to 8.9875 times 10 to the power 9. The units are Newton, meter squared for Coulomb's squared. Or we can use 8.99, 10 to the power 9 newton meter squared per coulomb squared for convenience. Now after experiments k is found to be equal to 1 divided by 4 pi epsilon 0 where epsilon 0 has a value 8.8542 times 10 to the minus 12 coulomb squared per newton meter squared where epsilon 0 is called the permittivity of free space. Permittivity of free space. Now, the force between these point charges is repulsive if the charges are of the same nature, same sign. For instance, Q1 and Q2, if both these charges are positive, these are separated by distance r, the force acting on these particles is repulsive. Now, the force on Q1 due to Q2 is F12, because force is a vector. And force acting on on Q2 to Q1 is F21 and according to Newton's third law the force are equal and opposite so F12 is equal to minus or negative F21 in this case the force is acting in this direction force acting on charge Q1 due to charge 2 and the force acting on Q2 due to Q1 is F to 1. Now if the charges are of opposite sign, Q1 and Q2, let these be two point charges separated by a distance R, let this be a positive charge and let this be a negative charge. In this case, the force is attractive. If So the charges are of opposite sign, which is one of the charges is positive, the other charge is negative, then the force is attractive. And if the charges of the, are of the same sign, which is either both of them are positive or negative, the force is repulsive. Now as we can see, the force on Q1 due to Q2 is F1, me, F1 2 in this direction. And the force acting on Q2 is F2 1 due to Q1 is pointing in this direction. And the force, F12, is equal and opposite to the force acting on F uh, Q2 due to Q1. Now let us see a simple example to find the force between two point charges, each one coulomb, separated by a distance of one meter. Q1 is equal to Q2, is equal to one coulomb, 100 coulombs, and the distance R is one meter. Now from the formula, F equals to one divided by four pi epsilon zero, Q1, Q2 divided by R squared, we can substitute the values of Q1 and Q2, and 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 can be conveniently written as 8.99 10 to the power 9, and the two charges are 1 times 1 divided by 1 squared, that gives you 8.99 10 to the power 9 newtons as the force between these two point charges. Since the charges are of the same sign, the force is repulsive. Thanks for watching this video.